You're listening to CKHA 100.9 Canoe FM, broadcasting from Halliburton County, Ontario. Well, it's 3 o'clock. Welcome to Saturday Escape. If you uh, haven't been listening, I'm Dan Sullivan, your host. We're here for one more hour. Uh, now, as I mentioned uh, at the start of the show, uh, I want to tell you a little bit about uh, our good friend, Minden resident and uh, canoe on-air host, Maureen James. As most of you know, Maureen passed away recently after a short but courageous battle with cancer. Maureen was born in Montreal, and then after moving with her family several times, they eventually settled in Florida, which is where she grew up. It's funny, I don't think of Mo as being a French-Canadian or a Floridian girl, for that matter, but that's, uh, that's her background. Uh, Maureen left a, a big impression, though, in Florida, uh, having been asked nicely, asked nicely, what does that mean exactly, to leave the Montgomery Fields School of Charm. <laughs> if you know anything about Maureen, you know why they asked her to leave. After graduating high school at 16, she then headed at 16 on her own to Toronto, where she started her career in the uh, advertising and marketing business. Maureen's passion, though, was comedy. She joined the uh, Second City Comedy Group um, and did her uh, auditions with some guy named John Candy. Ever heard of him? My goodness, she's, uh, she's worked with him. Maureen also did some training and shared the stage with Robin Williams. There's another name you might recognize. She then performed at the uh, Yuck Yucks Comedy Clubs, and did stand-up comedy at many different uh, venues all around Ontario. It was actually at the uh, Second City Comedy Group where Maureen met Lorraine McNeil. There's another name you might recognize for the first time. And uh, the comedy duo and uh, friendship of Lo and Mo was formed. Did you know that Lorraine and Maureen had a uh, television show on the Life Network called a Look at Life with Lo and Mo. They also appeared together on an episode of How to Look Good Naked Canada. Now, I have seen the episode. It's a good one. Um, those two would do anything for a laugh. Maureen was uh, always very involved in her community as well. She worked in the community when she first moved up here for Parker Pad and Printing, where a former co-worker of Maureen's had this to say. To her friends, Maureen brought a never-ending supply of love, support, happiness, and lots of laughter. After retiring, Maureen uh, volunteered with many organizations here in the Halliburton Highlands. She did volunteer reading at the Archie Stouffer School in Minden. Uh, she acted in many Highland uh, Summer Festival plays, most notably as the hilarious Reverend uh, uh, Mother Mary Regina. <laughs> in uh, nonsense and i think they reprived that role and and uh, they did two different nonsenses up here and uh, maureen was in both she she did a lot of uh, stuff for the highland summer festival she also volunteered at the adult daycare program at highland crest and as a hospice uh, volunteer in the community but we here at canoe fm know her best as uh, the mo half of laugh in the country with uh, lo and mo and maureen's show with Mark Arike called Go With The Flow with Mark and Mo. A uh, couple great shows uh, that aired here on Canoe FM. Maureen's last on-air appearance here uh, at Canoe uh, was co-hosting this very show, Saturday Escape, with myself last year. Um, I believe it uh, was late November. Maureen will be missed, for sure, uh, mostly by her husband John, her two girls, Julie and Emily, her two uh, stepchildren, Carolyn and uh, Tim, and of course uh, her three grandchildren, Cameron, Benjamin, and uh, Clara. She'll also uh, be missed by her two sisters, Lois and Nancy, as well as her niece, Lisa. And of course, uh, she'll also be missed by her many close friends on uh, Horseshoe Lake and all around uh, our community at large. So in closing, what, I, what I'd like to do, <laughs> this is going to be a little funny, I'd like to play Maureen and John's wedding song. Now, I know what you're thinking. That's going to be some sappy, slow song, something like I Can't Help Falling in Love by Elvis or We've Only Just Begun by the Carpenters. But if you know Mo and John the way I do, um, if you know anything about Mo and John, you'll know that it's not going to be sappy. It's going to be hilarious. The song is called In Spite of Ourselves. Uh, it's by John Prine. I don't know if you know the song or not, but I encourage you uh, to listen to the words. 
It's a hilarious song, one that I call very Mo-ish. She don't like her eggs all runny. She thinks crossing her legs is funny. She looks down her nose at money. She gets it on like the Easter Bunny. She's my baby. I'm her honey. I'm never gonna let her go. She ain't got late in a month of Sundays. Caught him once and he was sniffing my undies. He ain't too sharp, but he gets things done. Drinks his beer like it's oxygen. He's my baby, and I'm his honey. Never gonna let him go. In spite of ourselves, we'll end up sitting on a rainbow. Against all odds, honey, we're the big door prize. We're gonna spy our noses right off of our faces. There won't be nothing but big old hearts dancing in our eyes. She thinks all my jokes are corny Convict movies and make her horny She likes ketchup on her scrambled eggs Swears like a sailor when she shaves her legs She takes a lickin' and keeps on ticking. I'm never gonna let her go He's got more balls than a big brass monkey He's a whacked out weirdo and a love bug junkie Sly as a fox, crazy as a loon Payday comes and he's a howling at the moon. But he's my baby. I don't mean maybe. I'm never gonna let him go. In spite of ourselves, we'll end up a sitting on a rainbow. Against all odds, honey, we're the big door prize. We're gonna spy our noses right off of our faces. There won't be nothing but big old hearts dancing in our eyes. In spite of ourselves, we'll end up a sitting on a rainbow. Against all odds, honey, we're the big door prize. But we're gonna spike our noses right off of our faces. There won't be nothing but big old hearts dancing in our eyes. There won't be nothing but big old hearts dancing in our eyes. In spite of ourselves. In spite of their selves. That was uh, Mo and John's wedding song, if you can believe it. Hey, we're going to carry on with the music. Let's have, uh, let's have a great final hour of Saturday Escape. Thank you for listening. I want to tell you how Jesus came into my life. Okay. I felt him go through my body. I felt his spirit go through my body, ended up through my nostrils, and exited through my very active anal gland. I see. How could we make money from this? We can't make any money from that, I don't think. And uh, we're going to kick this off with uh, one, another one of Maureen's favorite songs. I think you'll recognize this one. It's astounding, time is fleeting, madness takes its toll, but listen closely. Not for very much longer. I've got to keep control. Just a 
jump to the left. And then start to the right. With your hands on your hips. Dreamy, oh fantasy, free me, so you can't see me. No, not at all. In another dimension, with voyeuristic intention. Well secluded, I see all. With a bit of a mind flip, you're into the time slip, and nothing. Can never be the same. You're spaced out on sensation. Like you're under sedation. Hit me.